I am an LGBTQ person that lives in Brooklyn, and I would love to uh, just participate in what I know is this wealth of um, resources that are available for people like me. Being in Jamaica, you have to be closeted. Uh, if you were open or holding hands, walking down the streets, you would be stoned to death, chopped, stabbed, run over by a car. New York City is the safest city when it comes to protection of transgender rights and transgender people. This is the only city where I feel safe. It took me a while to accept a few things and to, to adapt to the changes. You know, there's a lot of culture shock. I missed family, home, friends. Even though your life is good here and you don't want to go back, um, there's just some part of you that never thought you were going to stay here forever um, and some part of you that didn't want to stay here forever. Even though we've grown up in vastly different countries and brought up differently and love different foods, somehow there's this connection, this bond, this understanding. There's no words to describe how it feels to finally become um, a permanent resident in the U.S. I want to say to the people who are currently in process, hold strong. After you submit your paper and you do what you're supposed to do, it's all out of your hands. You have to wait on the process. Everyone's process is different. Just never give up. It, it will be, it will definitely be worth it in the end.